is Zhang Xu Xiang, Chen Yu, and Korea's Kim So Yong, and Kong Hee Yong. So here they come. This is going to be a high quality affair, I can tell you. Kim and Kong, the defending champions, who could make a bit of history if they do succeed this year um, and take it all the way because they'll be the first Korean women's pair in 30 years to retain their title. And looking at the head to head, very close, just one nothing. That was the All England last year. 21 14, 25 23. Or black. Black. So you have red. How close was that? It is black. This side, serving or receiving. Who will serve? Cha. Who will receive? So the last pair, by the way, 1994, that was Chung So Yong and Gil Yong Ah, who completed the double. Now I have to say, Kim Kong, as they are known, <laughs> uh, Kim So Yong and Kong Hee Hong, have dropped off the boil uh, recently. They were one of the most explosive pairs. Um, look at a year back. Uh, before we get to them, let's look at Zhang Chuxian, 24 years old, all in Sichuan. It's been as high as number two with Zheng Yu. That was 23rd of May, 2023. Uh, capable pair, of course, bronze medalist at the World Championships last year, Copenhagen. There's Zheng Yu, 28 years old, the experienced part of the pair. Last year, semi-finalists. They were second at the Indonesia Masters, the India Open, and the Malaysia Open. It's just been runner-up spots for them, but what consistency. And in 2023, 15 events, quarterfinals or further. This is how they've progressed to this quarterfinal. Jong and Kim, that's a tough match, 47 minutes. And Krasto and Ponapa, one of the up-and-coming Indian partnerships, well, for Krasto anyway, 55 minutes in three games. And I say that because Ashwini Panapa, of course, has the experienced part of that partnership. But that as a pair, they have only played recently. So Kim So Young, 30 year, 31 years old, definitely the captain of the team. Let's put it that way. And she's constantly talking to her partner, Kong Hee Young. Always plays with a smile on her face. And look, she's smiling right now. That's always, I find, a great attitude and outlook to have in terms of badminton. But as I said, very, very good pair. Uh, interchangeable backcourt, frontcourt. They like to play that explosive style. Kong Hee Young, 27 years old, very deft around the net. Former world number ones, of course. And that was back in 2022. Results so far for them. Uh, Li Jing and Liu Zhu Min, that was helped a little bit by retirement, sadly, in 25 minutes. And then Catherine Choi and Josephine Wu, while they were always the favorites there, with all due respect to the Canadians, 28 minutes. And look at that, 21-9, 21-11. So, well, could you say a gifted uh, draw? Probably. But still, they've made it here. So, umpire for this one, York High School. And it should be Simon Dart in the, there he is, in the service judge area. So this, a repeat of the semi-final in 2023 that was won by Kim and Kong, of course, who went on to the title for them. Last year's finalist, well, quarter-final in India. That was the only thing they've done in 2024, but in 2023, 10 events, quarter-finals or further, five finals and four titles. So even if you call that an off year, they have delivered. Well, let's see if that fast, explosive play from Kim Kong can outdo Zhang and Zheng. On my right, Kim So Yong, Kong He Yong, Korea. And on my left, Zhang Xu Xian, Sheng Yu, China. Zhang Xu Xian to serve. 
Och Kim So Young Lavol Play Once again, as predicted, the Chinese pair playing in blue. No. Just pushed a little bit wide by Kim. Of course, being a direct repeat of the 23 semi final, and revenge is really the name of the game for Zheng and Zhang. Service over to one. And Kim and Kong, as I said, looking to make a little piece of history if they can make it through to the final. And we've already seen one Korean defending champion, An Se Young, today. Alfian and Ardianto in the men's doubles, they're still in the mix. In fact, the only champion that's not is Li Shifeng, who was out in the first round. That's never happened before in the men's singles in 125 years at the All England Championships. A wrong piece of history for Li Shifeng. Good start from Zhang and Zheng. soak up the defense that might be a dangerous game against a pair like Zhang and Zheng service over five two by Kong. Six, two. Hey. Oh, just clips the line. Seven, Beautiful two. shot. So accurate from Zheng Yu. Caught them a little flat. Service over three seven. Thank you. Incredible one in twenty twenty four from Zhang and Zheng. Three finals three, seven. two against Lu Sheng Xu and Tan Ning runner-up in all three the other one was against Matsumoto and Nagahara in the Indy Open three finals in 2023 100% record three wins Too high. Four, eight. 
Shusian picking a spot. Kong Hee Yong with the defense. Steps in nicely, Kong. But again, Zheng Yu right up at the net. Service over. You can see how Nine. close she is there. Gets even closer. Play. There you can see Kim having that constant chat with Kong. It's a great defense from Kim. Service over. Five. Well, they haven't been able to get into the attacking stride that they would love to, which is just a repeating smash pattern. But that's because Zhang and Zheng are just keeping it nice and flat over the net. So it's a different type of match that they've entered into. Funnily enough, that's exactly what Zhang Shushan just did, what Kim and Kong would love to do. flash of that smash pattern this time it works for them trailing but beginning to show some signs of life in the attacking side of things And it's 11 7 at the first interval. So back on court, I noticed that Zhang Xuxian is wearing almost a corset. I wonder if that is for any kind of stretch. 11-7. Strain. There, there it is. I just think don't usually see that in action. there for back support I'm thinking oh, just a little indicator that while it's wonderful to watch badminton players execute these great shots and move around the court that there is a physical strain that they never talk about unless it's physically seen 
Oh, nicely dropped in by Zheng Yu. Zach, right place, right time. Well, Perfect shot. Seven. Well, 18, 19 points played in just eight minutes. That's a testament to how short and sharp these rallies have been. Well, a bit of confusion in terms of positional awareness. Shang Shuxian cleans up and forces the mistake. They are very much in control here. 13, 7. I guess they are the new ZZ Top. There are so many. Well, a couple of pairs I can think of. Shang Nan and Zhao Yunlei with the original ZZ Top doubles partnership out of China. Shang and Zheng fits just fine. Though, to be honest with you, at their age, I doubt they'll know who ZZ Top was. Shusian just can't connect over the net. He's trying to switch the play to the left side. 13. No, very far back. Led. Kim and Kong. 8.30. High school just asking for a bit of silence, I think, from the crowd. <laughs> Shen Yu pushes that wide. Nine, 13. Well, the old guy school has okay. determined Thanks. that that wasn't a fault in any way, didn't touch either of the Korean players. It's a very, very grey area. Oh, well, it's close, though. In fact, there was one match, I remember, where a shuttle actually went through a player's ponytail, and that was judged as a fault. Service over. 14, 10. Play. Change. Oh, what a serve that was. Gets from Kim and Kong. Cheng Yu absolutely all over that point, and Zhang Shusian just steps in at the right time to put the cherry on the point, really. 16, well, they're six points up, and they really have put in a combined performance. Well deserved of this lead. So young with the. Service over. 
11. Not big smash, 16. but the right smash. Well, okay. I have a funny feeling that's another yeah, reminder that's of noise. Yes, it is. New York High School. The Play. crowd just getting a little bit too into this match. It is great to see, of course, so many people here at the Utility Arena. 12, 16. The badminton does require, if not demand, certain actions from them silence during play and of course no flash photography being the principles well when Zhang Chuxian gets onto that smash attack and now they're onto it Zheng Yu joining Worked out well. Check. There's that chat. 30, 60. Ladies, play. Oh, that was absolutely perfectly dropped onto that. She wasted no time in getting on to the chat either. She tell you that 17, that 13. chat between Kim and Kong doesn't just uh, remain on court even after the match. You see them all over the place, and they're constantly just reviewing what they've done, how they can get themselves better. It's that self improvement, that team improvement. Wonderfully dropped in by, I think it was Zheng Yu. Yes, it was. 18, 13. Just a bit flat at the back. A little Chusian. Kong Hee Young in the exact right point Four, to kill it off. But eight, even eight. with all of this extra attack that's coming from the Korean side, look at that score. Still four points ahead. And that lead has pretty much remained untouched this first game. Passage of play. Oh, Zhang Xuxian in that point. Just changed the axis of the court, just decided to play left, right. It was that great rotation, then she's back again. Two points away. 19-14. Well, it really is all the big names in all the big games here at the All England. Court one currently tied Su Ying against Hei Bing Zhao. It's a real badminton treat everywhere you look, both courts. Dropped in beautifully. 
And there's that vision again. 26 game points. Game point 14. 18 minutes played. Look at that. That's high. Service oh. over. It's a little bit off 15, balance, Zheng Yu. 20. Almost right took that battle. with a one foot base. Slay. Start going wide. 21 15. First game won by Shang Xu Xian. Shang Yu 21 15. Seconds. So back on court for game two. And as you could see, just mid-game interval, that conversation just never stops. There's one thing that they do at 110% Kim and Kong, and it's communication. Concerning is that Shang and Zheng, 21 15, 18 minutes on the relatively worse side of the court. Though, as I've said on so many occasions, drift and the very slight drift they have here in Birmingham, just uh, while it affects doubles a lot less. So that first shot did look like it caught a little bit of wind. Because now that breeze is coming from behind Kim and Kong. Great bit of defending by Zheng Yu, who's now on the attack. She's got the height, Zheng Yu. To make it work. Two, love. She's five foot nine. Sheng Yu. Her partner is a little bit shorter. 
course, it's not just about the height you have. It's really where you are on court, the base that you have, and she finds great positions. Oh, wonderful defense. Just dragged that a bit. Service over. One, two. Well, so far on course for revenge. Change the trouble. For that S, uh, for that semi final last year. Sam just can't connect. Two, all, change. Challenge being called there by Kim. Called in. Well, honestly, that play was so fast, it didn't really get enough of a look on it. It's a surprise to me as well. But I'm guessing they wouldn't have called it if it wasn't extremely close. Here it comes. Oh, not extremely close. Correction out. But that was Three, called two. in. Wow. Speed of play. Play. Start to the second game for Kim and Kong. Shusian at the back. Now they switch. Good rotation. Zheng Yu now at the back. And the bounce off the net. Service over. Oh, it wasn't just the net. Three, four. Looks like it was a string as well. Tell you one thing, Zheng Yu's going to have to watch that bucket of rackets. It's getting a little bit precarious. Dropped in by Kim. Service over. Five, three. Tiniest of touches. Thank you. Provide the shuttle. 
Tá. Five three. Well, they've nurtured out a two-point lead. Had to work hard for it. It's Kong Young steps in Six. to make that three. three. Can get ready. At a very Four, awkward angle, right six. on the body. better Six. they found the speed of the rhythm that they need to play at the score against Chang and Zhang but that of course needs accuracy <laughs> that's gone long no it's in Defending by Zheng Yu. It's now shuffled her way back into position. Flat defense from the Chinese pair. Oh, instinctive defense from Zheng. And a fault called in the end. Definitely gone long. Service over. Six, eight. What a play by Zheng Yu. Well, on the turning, these attacks against Kim and Kong. Very much aware of the increased intensity of attacks coming from the Koreans. And they're just deflecting them wide if they can. And 
And this is a dangerous time for Kim and Kong. Started well, had built a lead. Now tied up at eight. Steep from Zheng Yu. Well, they're not a pair, Kim and Kong, to drop their heads, but they do, I think, realize now that they're going to have to come up with yet another idea. Thank you. After leading, now 10-8 down and on the brink of the second mid-game interval. out by, I think it was Kim at the front. Over. Kong just Nine. lurking behind her. Finds an angle right Change. down the line on the left side. Change and we're not at the break yet. Fight back. Ten all. that lead in the end a couple of mistakes from Zheng Yu and it's 11-10 to Kim and Kong Shang and Cheng really maxing out that mid-game interval. Play. They're not looking too happy, but they are the smiliest pair, to be honest. They let their rackets do the talking. And let's see what they can do here after a rejuvenated Kim and Kong. Snatched a one point lead. That is over. 11 on. How about that? Cheng Yu has 
12, 11. As you can see, been reprimanding herself. A couple of shots up at the net, and now defences as well have gone a bit astray. Very high. Oh, wonderful from Zheng Yu. Oh, this is a great rally. But you just know if Zheng Yu's up at the net and it comes back that high. Just a flick of the wrist, and it's down. That's the position where she's the most dangerous. So 13 all. She's missed it this time. I was just talking about how dangerous she was from that exact position. But as you can see, strings popped. And this is playing right into the hands. Well, now 15 14, but still playing right into the hands of Zhang and Zheng. But just not far enough ahead to Kim and Kong. Of course, they'll quite happily take it, even if it's just a one point win in the second game. Try and force a third. And Zheng and Zhang, with a combination of a few mistakes can be right back in this. Service over, 15 all. Quick click. Thank you. Oh. 
15 all. What a time to pull out a couple 17, of decent points. 15. Well, that's Hebing Jiao on court one. Big game happening there with Tai Tzu Ying. It looks like she might just have picked up a bit of a knock. Meanwhile, back on court two. It's all hands on deck. That's gone wide. That's gone long, sorry. Oh, they needed that point. Service over. 16, 17. Got a noise there. Let's let. start again, please. Now. And York High School calls a let. Just still one point in it. gone long service over 18 16 And they left it well. Service over. 17. 18. Close indeed. Service over. 19, 17. Ah! 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 Well, this is a glorious opportunity for Kim and Kong. Prepare quicker. Much. And York High School just reminding all four players to get ready quicker. Keep that flow going. 1917. Crucial serve for Kong Yong. They've got one of them. So 
three game points. 17, game point, 17. Push it to extra points. And that will certainly rattle Kim and Kong. It's come back a bit high. Delicate from Zheng Yu. Perfect lift again. Oh, that's gone wide. So Third and deciding Third game. Game one by Kim So Young, Kong Hae Young, 21 18. One game on. on the hard job which is level it up and so we get to final game absolutely fascinating Level. third game decider here Play. Zhang and Zheng starting with the drift just behind them but they have been successful on both sides of the court as you can see from the scoreline was very close in the second but has the momentum shifted to the defending champions? Mistakes falling left and right now for Zhang and Zheng. refocus a third mistake in a row Three, just not controlling that drift well enough <laughs> that's better from Shang Xuxian stops the rot. Service over. One, three. Service 
But it's a brief respite. Fired themselves up well. It's so often the case that that second win, as soon as they get a first game under their belt, creates that atmosphere. Nice movement by Kim and Kong. Again, outside. And it's just five, one. Four mistakes at the back line. And in all honesty, all from Zheng Yu. That hand movement indicates that they are aiming for mid-court. Won't take any chances at the back line. Two five. Well, they're an absolutely transformed pair now, Kim and Kong. The right place at the right time. Look at this Six, movement. Two. Well, this wipe down, I'm sure, is going to help Zhang and Zheng especially. Just break the rhythm, that momentum that Kim and Kong have built up so well. Thank you. Race to the finish line. Zhang, change the shuttle. Play. into the corner four points up <laughs> that was really well placed by Zheng Yu it's being very careful with her shots now as I'm sure any player would if they are guilty of four mistakes off the start. Three points back. What a shot. Difficult moving sideways. Service over. Eight, four. Absolutely plumb in that corner box.
Ooh, that was shaky ground for Shang and Zheng. That didn't work out for Kong at all. Five, eight. What a return by Kong, who has really come alive in this third five, game. Five. And in all honesty, was actually one of the reasons why he managed to pick up that second game as well. Fired into life. Something in that chat with her partner has brought back some lightning reflexes. First game, you wonder if they would have picked that up, but they doubt they now do. That's in close, but in seven, nine, two points back. Place, right time, and as we approached seven, the seven. final mid game interval, Ten, Kim and Kong still finding just enough to rattle Zhang and Zheng. What a completely different complexion to this match from the first game where they were really up against the wall. But now Kim and Kong finding that explosive power I was talking about right at the start of the match. The Kim and Kong of old. Seven is over. Eight. Ten. with the power good solid defense from Kong but just an awkward take it's like a half crouch defense Nine, ten. well Zhang and Zheng will be happy if they can get back in one point get back to the break one point back because they've been trailing in this third game by at times up to four points Served by Zheng Yu. Really wide. Ten, oh, Follows ten. it up with a body and then kills it to the body. Textbook move. One, I'm sure they've been practicing in training. Ten all. They've got themselves back in this. Oh, 
Oh, what a time for those mistakes to come in. 11-10, they'll be happy. 11-10. But they can still put in a decent fight. So back on court, and this is it. The conclusion to this epic quarterfinal in the women's doubles. The first of two, in fact, because the last match in this opening session on quarterfinals Friday will produce the semi-final opponent to whoever wins this. And it's Japan versus Korea, Ten. Fukushima and Hirota against Ten. Beik Hana and Lee Sohee. Cheng to receive. Oh, yeah. bit of the service protocol going on, and Yong Kai School just saying that they need to change. Sheng should be Assistant receiving. Cheng to receive. There you go. Hey. Eleven, ten, play. That's a good start. Service over. 11 off. Well, it was three games when they met in the semi final last year. Yeah, quite the rivalry building up between these two pairs. That's gone wide and long. 12. 11. That's what I mean about. Being one point back, the mid-game interval, close enough. Launch an attack, a rhythm's been broken when they start play again. That service action is just being so effective. 13, 11. Nice little touch in by Xuxian. been all about errors to kick off this final phase of action. So close to the body. up on the left side now back in position <laughs> Sheng Yu again with a mistake 14 
third team. Oh, these pairs are running out of points. Nicely plucked out of the air by Kong. 15, so, 13. Kim and Kong with a two point lead. Placed it just on the right side. stretched the Koreans ah! Kong with a very awkward take over. 14 15 it's nervous times indeed and the Korean coach just Taking a few deep breaths. Oh, how did they not finish that off? Now up against it. Kim So Young. 7 over. 16, 14. Oh, that was great from Kim looking for the angle. Absolutely all over the court at the moment. What a rally. Well, I can tell you now it's definitely going to be the longest rally of the match. No, oh, it's been pushed out. Just relentless pressure from the Koreans. 54 shots. 17, 14. And almost every single one of them. Class. Well, the defending champions have really had to dig deep in this quarterfinal. 17, 14, but now, play. with a shining opportunity, they can just hold their nerve. Speed of their play, the second and third games has been upped. Service over, 15, 17. Shusen had to stretch for that. Shen Yu a bit late on the return. They don't look as compact as before. 
That's a great pattern of play. Oh, it's in. Dropped in, and Kim So Young has stepped up when it counts. Last three winners have been from her racket. Service over 18 15. Beautifully dropped in into a very, very tight space. She has guided her partner well. And much like Anse Young, their compatriot in the singles, if they win this, they're going to celebrate like it's the final. That's gone long. Zhang and Zheng out of ideas. 19, 15. 75 minutes on court. Well, that stopped the rot for now. But really, with Kim and Kong at 19 over. points, there's no mistakes allowed for 15. the Chinese pair. 19. Nervy times. 17, 19. They don't just need the points, they need that shift in momentum. If they can take it up to 18, tie it up at 19. That's high. Straight to the body from Kong. Still comes back. Oh, what a shot. And Kim is on hand to put the finishing touch on it. Three match points. And that was all about Kong Hee Young. Look at this shot. Service over. 20. Match point 17. What a match. Okay. Thank you. They were absolutely all at sea in the first game. on there's that wonderful pattern of play again from okay. Yong just shifting it oh he, she may have done it again I thought Kim and found the angle Sheng Yi was there keeps coming back wonderful play but that's how hard they have to fight now Zhang and Zheng couple of instances in that rally I thought Kim Service had it 18 20 Thank you. she lives to fight another day can Chang and Jeng take it to extra points and it's going to be really edge of the seat stuff
Cheng Yu trying. It's all hands on deck for Kim and Kong. They can't get on the attack. They're too busy defending. Oh, what a brilliant shot. And there's the celebration. She just saw that spot. Left side, front court. Killed all the power off the shuttle. Drops it in. And it's been an incredible comeback from one game down. They're one step closer to becoming the first Korean pair. Women's doubles in 30 years to defend their crown. 21-18. 81 minutes on court. Look at that. It's beyond cheeky. Absolutely incredible stuff. They just don't know how to give up. So there's confirmation of it. 15-21, 21-18, 21-18. And the defending champions through to the last four.